Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how to create a bubble effect. We are using the liquid because you make it animation in liquid. We need to some bubbles for make it to so realistic. So it's a very simple step I was to tell. So make it a line by line. You can do it. You can get the perfect bubbles. So. If you are a beginner, just uh, subscribe my channel. It's for useful for you. I have posted many tutorials for After Effects in animations, so tips and tricks also. You can just follow my YouTube channel, subscribe it as always in Instagram too. So let's good video now. So I was adding them my project file and support files in description. So just download it and use it for your. Uh, reference as well as your support because of uh, I was added a AA file for the uh, chemical picker so it's very useful because of what the later I will tell what I want to try to say so now drag it out the AA file into your After Effects just click OK now you can see the picker will be added in but now it's too large as per your ratio so uh, i was resize the picker so just press the s key for your keyboard i mean in your keyboard and you can easily adjust the layer that's okay now you need to reposition now you can reposition the picker to the down so you need to position value just hold the shift and press p you can see the position will be here now you move the picker in y axis now it's cool now you can see the picker is ready and now go to the you need bubble effect am i right so right click it and new and adjustment layer now you can see you can create an adjustment layer just click click it because of you need to go into add a bubble so click effect control panel i mean effect preset panel and type cc bubble uh, you can drag the simulation into your adjustment layer now you can see it was uh, it was making it in your overall uh, ratio pair so you need to mask it now so go to the tool for you can see here the pen tool is a shortcut for the pen tool is g now select it now and create a shape of mask for your uh, object which object are you using i was using in this picker so just i was draw the path around inside i mean you need to uh, because you need a bubbles in in your uh, inside your uh, picker just so, so i was create a path inside a picker if you need a you was juice the variety of pickers or glasses some whatever so i you need to create a mark as per your given object so that's okay now i was create a mask now you can hear you can see the mask options now you can apply the further will be a 50 um 50 is not good and uh, mask expansion will be minus minus 50 because of if you can see the layer will be uh, too tightly i was drawing in your picker so that's why in the bubbles will be go to outside of the picker it's not look like uh, nicely so that's why i created this and use the free feather will be a 50 now it's cool now 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 you can uh, go to the uh, bubble cc bubbles you can now change the bubble amount will be 50 to 150 to 400 it's cool but uh, bubble size will be too large so adjust the bubble size one will be good i think so it's cool you can see bubble value will be zero now we can play the uh, play the animation 
can see the bubble was created and is going through the way and an app is perfectly cool now okay i hope it was uh, make it, it i already told you it was very useful so now you can see uh, it, it was simply added but the bubble will be a uh, uh, pure white so you need to make it a color as per your liquid so i go to the add one more thing uh, this is a gradient ramp uh, was drag it out in your adjustment layer now you can see and drag it out into the up before the cc bubbles now you can choose the start of ramp will be here and end of the ramp will be in up now you can choose the start color will be a dark green uh, in your liquor which one is dark this will be dark but you can select it by in here to sir and the up color will be a light green you can choose it bright it okay cool now now you can see now you can see the bubbles will be ready but the bubbles is too dark because of the adjustment layer is upside of your adjustment i mean asset layer so just drag it down into down now you can see the difference bubble will be in uh, look like in uh, like uh, in chemical so just now we can play the video from start first you need to fit here and now fit here now play the video you can see the liquid will be uh, moving from i mean bubble will be moving from in the bottom of the chemical and go to outside of your uh, through the mouth of picker can cool lisi now uh, already uh, one the final will be uh, the tips and important thing i was already told you why i am choosing a ai file because of you can easily change the color of your object i mean vector so if you need to change the chemical color i mean is green you need to change orange or red or blue whatever which one you need it you can easily change it by you can uh, only using the ai file not uh, jpg or a png like so you can easily it's a very important thing so just uh, uh, just watch it and use it at your project so first you need to select the ai file layer and right click it and go to the open now you can see the fourth option will be the edit original by clicking this is automatically detect the ai uh, software if you have in your laptop or pc is automatically open otherwise you can't use it this step you just skip skip it if you have it is already uh, i was create the file in ai illustrator so now we can see this liquid will be a chemical i will rename it so just select this and re recolor the chemical by click here you can change the knob if it's orange if you need a red changes little bit now you need to save the file before you close it so control s the and save the file and control q will be close it now you can automatically change the color here but you need to change the bubbles colors too because of it's not automatically change it so you need to change the color so just uh, start up color will be a dark now change this color into the dark red and and the end color will be light green so i mean light red so just bubble it you now click okay now play the video from start to end you can see the bubble is created and we go through the same way but bubble is red so this is a very useful thing you can make it at many variable colors by changing these steps for by just using this step you can make it many more uh, variant of uh, bubbles and color chemicals so i hope you you like this tutorial if you are like this tutorial and is useful for you and as well as is i think it's inspiring you so don't forget to like my tutorial i mean video and support my channel so don't forget to subscribe it
uh, if you give the comments below it's useful for uh, my inspiration how i posted it and how i you thought if you you can easily understand or whatever if by you can say it that that's why you can i can understand what you feel so so don't forget to comment it below i and thank you guys have a nice day bye